Uh, I'm Joakim Annenbeck. I work as a new machine concept specialist in the Volvo construction equipment in Eskilstuna, Sweden. And uh, the Ajax machine concept, that's one of my babies, so to say. And uh, you have seen the Ajax 01, the prototype that we built in uh, 2015. And we showed that at the Exploration Forum in September 2015. That was a very early prototype. Not a lot of engineering done before we build the machine. So with that we tried out the machine concept with the bi-directional uh, functionality and four-wheel steering, four-wheel drive, the out automation and such. We found the concept very successful, so we're moving forward with an HX02, which is uh, conceptual very similar to the HX01. As you see, it's still one big body on top of a uh, uh, truck-style uh, chassis. And still the four-wheel drive and four-wheel steering. The changes that we are doing is, is that we have matured the concept quite a lot. And actually utilizing more of the internal components and systems that we have in the Volvo Group. Which goes for uh, the electromobility we have. Uh, more commonality in the drivetrain than what we had on the first one. We are designing a new axle where we integrate the electric motor in the axle to save space and increase the efficiency of the machine. So we have, we have in principle taken the, the concept to the next level. And uh, that's also a part of why we are here to get some feedback from, from real customers. Is this something that actually can be useful? And is there in, an interest for, for this kind of machine? And showing this very early HX02 prototype. Do you see this as bringing the company, you said it's a step closer in terms of the technology. Um, do you see this as like the next step towards a production model machine at some point in time? Or is it yeah. to say? We are developing the HX02 within the electric side project that we run together with Skanska and the Swedish Energy Agency. And end of next year we will have a fleet of those machines, the HX02. Eight machines up and running in one of their quarries. And if that is a successful uh, tryout, then, then uh, I would say we could be rather close to an uh, introduction. But we have no dates, no decisions taken yet. And also that's why we have the green color, which is X-Labs, research and not for sale.